Have you ever wondered how to solve a Rubik's Cube? Well, today I am going to fill part two of my Rubik's Cube tutorial. In the first part of the tutorial, I made a daisy and turned the daisy into a cross. Lastly, I made the first layer. If you haven't watched part one of the tutorial, I will put it down in the description. Okay, so in this tutorial, we're going to make the second layer. And I'm going to show you how it looks like. Make it... The, the, the way that I did it isn't the way that you guys are going to do it. I just did my advanced method. But this is what the first two layers would look like. Okay, let's get started on this tutorial. Okay, so when we're making the second layer, we need to add the edges in the right places. So just like we did with the corners, besides that it has one less color, we're going to put these in to where they go. So, for example, like if I had this in the right place, it would be like so for example like since there's red green right here it would have to be a red green edge piece okay so this is what you're supposed to do to put the edges in so let's see here so we have blue and red and i'm gonna find the blue and red edge piece remember these are edge pieces when they have two colors on them and here it is so when we find it we're going to put it on top to see if it matches with the right side or the left so since it matches with the left center this is a blue blue um when you have this case you're going to move it to the side to this side here with this top move and we're going to do this algorithm so this is the algorithm that i taught you guys in the last one r u r prime u prime you should do and you're going to turn this way like that and then you're going to do this move here. This is called L prime. And then you're going to do G prime. Like this. And then L. And that puts the edge in. The next case that you can have is when you try to align it here, but it's actually flipped. So it doesn't align with the red unless you actually flip it. But it aligns with this one. So when it aligns with this one, we're basically going to do the opposite of what we just did. So I'm going to move it this way to the back. And we're going to start from here. And then we're going to do that algorithm, like kind of reverse, but not exactly reverse. So we're going to do L prime, this move, and then U prime, just this move. We're going to do L, this move, and we're going to do U, which is this move. And then we're going to rotate this way, and we're going to do R, U, R prime to insert the edge. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys the rest of the cases that I have here. So as you can see, this is aligning with the green. So I'm going to move it to the side. And I'm going to do R, U, R prime, U prime. I'm going to rotate and I'm going to do L prime, U prime, L. So I'm just going to change this case so I can give you guys a visual of the other case that I had. So basically what we're going to do is, as you can see, this aligns with the right edge i mean the right center here so we're going to move this to the side and we're going to do l prime u prime l u rotate and r u r prime now you should be done with the second layer thanks for watching and also if you want to see more videos like this please like and subscribe and part three will be coming soon